an aspiring chef, young or old, male or female, what's the single most important thing they can do to help them achieve their goals? Well, they got to really want to do it because this is not just, you know, you don't, it's nothing like getting a job. Mm. And it's very easy in life for you to buy yourself a job. But if you really have a passion to do this, um, you should try to go to culinary school, either a six month program or an 18 month program if you can. Um, but nothing is ever learned unless you work. Again, it comes back to work. So I would borrow, beg, or steal any amount of money you had to and go find, you know, send resumes out to the 25 most, you know, the greatest restaurants that you think they know about that exist. It's always like they're in zoos that are spectacular that you would want to work at. Mm-hmm. And go work at those restaurants even if, if you work for nothing. Wow. Because you'll never have an opportunity as you're going up the work ladder in life, you know, once you start taking a job for money, then you're going to get the job that is paying the most, is going to get you the most responsibility, but it's probably clerical responsibility. So if you really want to cook and learn and create, you got to start from the bottom. So I would go and work two years with the greatest chef you can find hmm. and just suck their brains, you know? Yep. That's yep. what it's all about. Yep. Watch, look, learn, gain the wisdom. Just um, get in, kill yourself. Just, just commit two years of absolute staggering amounts of work and hours and outwork everybody else and in two years you'll someone will pay you because you have this experience yeah. and uh and it just that's how it works and then you continue to get this experience as long as you can yeah. because you need to like you need to spend a good six years in a kitchen in some uh, two or three kitchens before you're really ready to come out and do like a, a larger mm-hmm. position or as a chef or as a sous chef or something you gotta spend you gotta put the time